Hi, Johan. Thanks for talking to us. Uh, tell us about what the atmosphere has been like in camp since you secured promotion. Yeah, it's been really good. Uh, we've done it quite early as well, so it's a, it's a bit weird that we have quite a lot of games left. Uh, but as I said, when we got promoted, we got a little bit of time to celebrate, but then we, we had the Chef U game as well, which was fantastic to win as well at home. Uh, but now it's all about just winning the title. Uh, we know we are one win away from that. So uh, yeah, that's our focus. And how focused are the players for for that title victory? I mean, you've had two draws since promotion. Is there a real hunger to get it done this weekend at home? Oh yeah, definitely at home. Uh, Turf Moor has been a tough place for the opposition to come to and we're going to keep that going on Saturday. Uh, and as I said, we want to win the title. Uh, it would uh, cap off a perfect season for us if we, if we do that, and especially at home as well. And it's a tough task against another team fighting against rele relegation. Is that going to prove problematic for you going into that game? Yeah, I mean, every game is is the, the opposition is going to give us some problems, uh, but we just have to make sure we think about ourselves that we we play our game. Uh, we know they're playing for quite a lot as well. Uh, so we just have to manage the game as as well as possible and and, and concentrate on us uh, we know if we if we play up to the standards we've been doing uh, we'll go into that game confident that we, we're going to get the three points and speaking to Vinny he was saying a lot of the players in camp in on the training field belong in the Premier League would you agree with them and are you guys ready and raring to challenge next season uh, I mean that's far away we know we've got a lot of great players in, in the squad that still haven't played in the Premier League and, and, and got, definitely got the potential to play in the Premier League. Uh, but that's that's a, a long, a far away. Uh, we just concentrate on, on the Championship, finishing that off. Uh, good summer holiday and then uh, we crack on with the Premier League. And personally, what has Vinny done for your game? How, how, what makes him such a good manager? Well, he's kept me on the field, so on the pitch, <laughs> that's, a, that's a start. Uh, no, as I said, I've, I've been fit the most of the most part of the season. That's been the most uh, important thing for me. Uh, and yeah, he's added. He's obviously I played it more in, in midfield. Uh, used to be on the wing more, uh, so that's uh, that's another different thing. But I'm confident in there. And to be fair, in any position he, he puts me in, and yeah, just a different style of football, a uh, different way of thinking about football. And uh, yeah, it's it's been absolutely brilliant. And have you been pleased with the team's development this season and what you've seen on the training pitch and in games? Yeah, definitely. I mean, in the beginning of the season, we didn't really know what was going to happen. Uh, a lot of changes at the club, a lot of players going out, players coming in. So it was a bit of an unknown. But uh, yeah, it's, it's it's been absolutely amazing. Uh, the staff have been fantastic. The players who have come in been fan fantastic as well. So yeah, just everything clicked. And as, as we've shown this, this season, we are the best team in the league. Fantastic. Cheers, Johan. Thank Thanks. You. All. Good luck for Saturday. Thank you. Morning, Johan. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Um, are you surprised just how well it has gone this season? Bear in mind, I mean, you obviously were here last season. You've seen how big a change happened at the club mm. last summer. Can you believe how well it has gone? Yeah, it's gone really well, but it's it's down to hard work as well. Uh, the staff have been absolutely relentless. Uh, meetings, uh, time on the pitch. Uh, they know exactly the way they want to play. Uh, the manager obviously has his uh, philosophy he wanted to implement, but yeah, it was, you never know in football how long it's going to take. And and this time around, it took yeah probably a little bit quicker than many would have thought. And uh, yeah, we're just happy to be back in in the best league in the world. That's where we want to be and and test ourselves. Uh, as I said, yeah, you never know in the beginning, but it just everything worked really well. You're part of a senior group of players at the club, you know, the likes of Barnsley, J Rod. Shall I say other people like that? How big of a um, leadership role have you taken? Because there's obviously there's so many young players in this in this side who've been new to this team and, and new to England as well. Yeah, just our obviously our experience trying to help the new lads integrate into the dressing room. As I said, a lot of new players came in, uh, trying to make them feel welcome and just try to keep the standards high uh, because we know that. The English English Championship is an extremely difficult league, and and uh, yeah, the standards have to be high every single training, every single game, and I think we've, we've done that quite well. I think we've been used in the past to see you being out on on the wing. Have you enjoyed playing in central midfield? And was it a position that you ever thought that you you would be able to to play as much as you have done? Yeah, I think so. I think I've got the quality to do that. Um, uh, I, I did that for Charlton, to be fair, a few yeah. times as well. So. Uh, but with Burnley, I was obviously mostly on the wing. Uh, we play a different system as well now, so so it's, uh, it suits me really well. I'm enjoying it. Uh, but as I said before, 
I'll play any position and I think I can do it quite well. On a personal as well, you've had a new contract as well this season. Just how big a boost was that for you on a personal basis to have your future committed to, to this club? Yeah, just as I said, I want to play in the best league in the world and that's Premier League and um, luckily we are there now. Uh, so that's where I want to test myself again and, and with the different style of football as well, which is going to be interesting. It's obviously been so many young players in the squad, it's already been said, how hungry are they to, to prove themselves in the Premier League? Because so many of them haven't played in, in the Premier League before. Yeah, they'll be definitely, I mean, they'll be hungry to play in this league. Uh, it's a different test, uh, it's more quality. Uh, and But we've shown it this season, I mean, Bournemouth away in the Cup, I think we did really well against Manu as well. Uh, I mean, Man City, I mean, everybody can go there and lose with a few 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 goals. So I think we've shown that we, we definitely can can uh, do really well in the Premier League and, and, uh, and uh, yeah, the players are going to be up for it. Just finally, you, obviously with those results, you know, obviously there is a gap to the Premier League and, mm. and the Championship. We all, we all know that. But like you say, in those performances that you've shown that, you know, you can compete on the day so you know it, does that give you confidence that you know you guys can all make that collective jump to to the Premier League yeah definitely and the way we play uh, I think is is going to be interesting uh, but we, as I said before we've shown that we can do it uh, but Premier League is, is, is an unknown as well for us for a lot of the players uh, but I'm confident in, this, in the staff and in the players that we're going to be absolutely fine cheers good luck this weekend no thank you thank you